In this video, we are going to look at how to collect the diagnostic information for VMware vCloud Director. This video was based on VMware Knowledge Base Article 1026312. There is a script which can be run in order to collect all of the vCloud Director log files into a single log bundle. The script is called vmware-vcd-support and it is located in the slash opt slash vmware slash cloud dash director slash bin directory. While this script is running here in my system, let's take a chance to talk about some of these log files. VMware vCloud director provides logging information for each cloud cell in the system. You can view the logs to monitor your cells and to troubleshoot issues. You can find the logs for a cell at the slash opt slash vmware slash cloud dash director slash logs directory. The following log files can be found in the logs directory. Cell.log is the console output from the cloud director cell. vcloud-container-debug.log contains the debug level log messages from the cell. vcloud-container-info.log contains informational level log messages from the cell. This log also shows warnings or errors encountered by the cell. VMware-VCD-Watchdog.log contains informational log messages from the cell watchdog. It records when the cell crashes or is restarted. Diagnostics.log. This is the diagnostics log for the cell. This file is empty unless diagnostics logging is enabled in the local logging configuration. The request.log contains the HTTP request logs in the Apache common log format. You can use any text editor or viewer or third party tool to view the logs. Once the support script is finished running, the log data will be stored in a single TGZ archive and you can upload this log bundle to VMware technical support if requested. For details on, to, on how to upload diagnostic information to VMware, please see VMware Knowledge Base Article 1008525. This concludes our look at how to collect the diagnostic information for VMware vCloud Director. For additional tutorial style videos, please check out the VMware Knowledge Base and the KBTV YouTube channel at the following links.